Bernadette, you're engineering Elvaro and Zach in the 23 McLaren this weekend. How have preparations gone ahead of the race today? I think preparations have been really good. Um, we had one day out here quite a few weeks ago and we got to know the track. It was a little bit wetter than it is this weekend, so we've got that extra heat element to deal with. Um, we got what, through free practice one and free practice two quite well yesterday. Obviously qualifying went well. Always you like to be a little bit closer to the front, but P4 I think we can do a lot from that. Um, especially given our race pace at Oulton, you know, we gained quite a few places from the positions that we'd started in that. So I'm quite confident that we can do something tomorrow. Just need to break up those courses in front of us a little bit, but it should be okay. What changes have you made to the car for the race? Um, we haven't changed very much from the race from qualifying, actually. Um, I think both Zach and Alvaro were relatively happy with the setup that we got to. Obviously, how the tyres will degrade at the end of an hour is a bit of an unknown, but I guess it's a bit of an unknown for most of the pet lane. So we'll just have to deal with that in the race. I think that will be a challenge, though, how we manage to get to the end of the hour. You're looking forward to getting it underway? Definitely looking forward to getting it underway. I think Ulton, there was a lot of positives for the team. There was a lot of positives for Zach. Obviously, Alvaro wasn't with us. Um, it'll be key to get the two of the two those two guys out together and running. And I think everyone's just really up for the challenge now and just wants to get it underway and get on the pit wall. It's going to be hot out there, so it's, I think everyone will be quite tired at the end of the two hours.